As a photographer and a filmmaker, I do alright, I get by, I make a living from it, so I can't be that bad. But when it comes to being a member of stuff, for shoots and whatever it is that I'm going out to do as a photographer and filmmaker, I am terrible. Now that doesn't mean that I go out and I forget my camera. Like there was this one time where I went to a shoot, well I got halfway there and then realised I left my camera bag by my front door. So I had to go all the way back home and then, that's another story anyway. What I mean is like forgetting the few small essential things that you need to have on you all the time when you are going out and doing shoots. And the stuff that I forget generally tends to be the exact same things every single time. Which is why I come up with the idea of having this. This is what I call my photographer's survival pouch. And after this video you're going to want to have one, I can promise you that. So this is the hook and loop hub pouch from Alpaca Gear. This video isn't sponsored by Alpaca Gear. They did send me this for free, but they're not paying me and they're not paying for my opinion on it. So what I will say is what I actually think. And this generally is used for EDC stuff. So people will have like a multi-tool in there. They'll carry a knife in there, a flashlight, maybe a lighter, stuff like that. Just so they don't have to have it all over their pockets. They can chuck this in the backpack or they can even just chuck this in their pocket because it's actually not that big. And it just saves having to like rummage around in your pockets and find stuff. But I thought I'd find a different use for it because the way it's laid out on the inside was perfect for me to have my photography survival gear in there and I like to carry my EDC in my pockets. So what I did was I found the few things that I always forget to have, organised this on the inside to be exactly how I need it to be with the stuff that I always forget to take with me. And now I don't have to remember all those little things, I just remember to pick this pouch up off my desk or wherever it is, chuck it in my car, chuck it in my camera bag or whatever and then Everything that I always forget is not forgotten because it's all in here all the time, ready to go. So let's open it up and I'll show you what's in there. Oh, and before we open it up, um, if anyone's got any Ranger eyes that they want to send me to, to put on here um, because, you know, it's got the Velcro bit on there, feel free to send me some because, yeah, it's looking a bit naked. Just saying. So when we open it up, as you can see, we are greeted with quite a lot of stuff, but this is all stuff that you need. So first off, as you can see, I've got slots right in the front on the right hand side for memory cards. I generally keep three memory cards in here. And as you can see right now, I've got two 128 gigs and a 64 gig. Generally, this is all I need to keep in here because my main memory cards that are always in my camera bag are the V90s that I do need to use in my A7S III. But if I manage to somehow go through all of my memory cards that I have in there, I can then just decrease the quality slightly, not shoot in all intra, and I can use these cards to then shoot anything else that I need to. Or if I'm just shooting photos, these are perfectly fine. So I keep these three in here at all times because then I've got like a lot of gigabytes worth of storage if I desperately need some spare memory cards when I run out of my others. Then behind here, I keep an SSD because, well, for whatever reason, then you need to store stuff so like if I'm out and about say I'm shooting a wedding I will when they're having their meal I'll go to my car and I'll do a dump of all the footage and photos that I've shot in the day so far and there's been times where I forgot to bring an SSD and my memory card to fall so it's essential to have an SSD with you this changes between the SanDisk one that I've got in there right now and a Samsung T7 both great SSDs I do prefer the T7 just seems to be a bit more good to use to be honest but this just stays in here it's a one terabyte it generally will never get filled up because it is there just as a backup like I said in case I forget to take my main SSDs with me to the shoots I just know that I've always got it there then behind that as well I have an SD card reader for your phone because there's been times where an out and clients are like can you shoot and edit on the go today? I'm like, well, I don't have my laptop with me and I don't have any way of getting the photos off my camera, so no. So after a few people asked me, I was just like, you know what? I'm gonna buy one of these, they're about 10 pound on Amazon. Plug it into your phone, put your SD card in the bottom, put everything straight into Lightroom, edit on the go and just send it off to the client on the go during the shoot and you can keep them happy because a happy client is what you want, isn't it? So that stays in there in case someone does go can you edit for me on the go? And I, do, I don't want to carry my laptop with me everywhere and all the drives and everything like that for just like a normal photo shoot. So that's there just in case. And then in the left-hand side of the pouch, of course, a multi-tool because they're the most handy thing ever. It's just a Swiss Army knife. It's got a knife on there or two knives on there. Bottle opener because you know, like if you had a good shoot day, you can go and get a beer after and you can use the bottle opener for that. And there's just scissors and 
all the kind of stuff on there that you could need for anything you need to do on set, say you're cutting tape, you've got a screwdriver on there with the bottle opener, so you've got that in case you need to go and do some screwing stuff. you got, it's a Swiss Army knife, they're the most helpful thing ever to have in any pouch, in any EDC that you can possibly imagine. So that stays in there at all times, and they come in so handy, like literally all the time. So if you haven't got one, get one and put it in your pouch or in your pocket or in your camera bag. And then the last thing on the inside of the pouch here is the small rig camera tool. This thing, when I found it and bought it, changed my life purely just for one of the tools on here, which is this. This is literally there for screwing tripod plates onto your camera and taking tripod plates off your camera and it saves you having to carry around like whatever pennies it is that fits into the tripod screw from whatever country you're from. It's just here. You never have to rummage around trying to find a penny or ask your mate, Oi John, have you got a penny? You... No one's got a penny. Now you can't get your tripod plate on and now you can't use your tripod. So it's always there. Along with screwdrivers, Allen keys, anything else you need for cine rigs or tripods or screwdriver and stuff. And there's little holes here, as you can see, that you can fit stuff in like different mounts for the bottom of ball heads on tripods and microphone adapters and stuff like that. And so for £20, just to keep with you all the time, godsend, absolute godsend. And then in the front, we have a little bit of money, depending on what country I'm in, I'll have different money. I'm in England at the moment, so £10 note, sometimes I'll be a 20 depending on how rich I am at the time. Just for lunch, basically, because Sometimes, depending on where you are, the places, it might just be like a food van, they don't take card. Or if you've got to pay for parking, you've, you've got some money there, because no one keeps cash on them anymore, do they really? I'm probably one of the last people that does. But it's there, just in case I don't. So that is literally everything I keep in there. And like I said, all of it is stuff that I always forget. It comes in so handy all the time to keep this stuff with me. And just having it in this little pouch means that I don't have to be like, have I got that? Have I got that? Have I got that? I just open the pouch up and go, yeah, it's all there, sound, let's go. And it's good. So thank you, Alpaca Gear, for sending this to me because it has changed my life. Everything in this video that I've spoken about will be linked down below, apart from the money because go and make your own. <laughs> and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope that now you can find another use for these little pouches because honestly, it's the most handy thing ever. It takes up no space and it will keep the essentials organized and with you at all times. So go out get one and don't be stressed out about forgetting shit ever again and on that note i'm gonna go make some lunch because i'm hungry see you later <laughs>